I'm hey, sorry. you know what? Get the hell out of here if you don't like this kind of preaching. What? Then get the hell out of my church. I'm the man of God here. I meet the qualifications. I run this church. You know, I don't believe in a young earth. And then the big dumb animal, Keith Gomez, just sits there and listens to him preach this. This is just completely sick. So the new IFB cult, the Stephen Anderson-led new IFB cult, held their red, uh, red hot preaching conference, is what they call it. And uh, one of their puppet pastors, Bruce Mejia, actually held up a severed head of a horror icon, horror freak, I guess you could call it. He probably bought from like Walmart or something like that during a good chunk of his sermon. He was apparently trying to use it to illustrate Ezekiel 8.3. Uh, this is just totally sick. A vexation warning. Here's the clip. It's not mean preaching. It's not average preaching. Pastor Jimenez doesn't preach average sermons. Pastor Shelley doesn't preach average sermons. So don't call it mean. And so this is you tonight. Amen. This is the kind of sick depravity of the new IFB cult led by Stephen Anderson because he holds up that severed head for like a good chunk of his sermon. It's totally disgusting. And I don't care if it's an illustration of Ezekiel 3 or whatever else, that's totally disgusting, especially when you have children around there too. But it shows the kind of depravity of the new IFB cult. See, Stephen Anderson, uh, back what happened in 2020, kind of gives an example of the sort of depravity that goes on behind the scenes, but now they're just openly showing it. You know, the new IFB cult led by Stephen Anderson has nothing to do with traditional, the traditional Baptist movement. Uh, it is a fringe sect and their leader is in uh, Tempe, Arizona. And all these puppet pastors just mirror the type of behavior of the cult leader, Steven Anderson. So I wanted to show you guys that. Again, totally sick and disgusting, but it's part of why I exposed this whole new IFB system that I, uh, it, uh, God saved me out of, I'll put it like that, uh, the proper way to put it. So anyway, may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Don't be deceived by this cult. Uh, goodbye. Thank you.